Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. Uh, one more thing, I want to talk about Ethereum again. And the fact is you actually want your ETH to actually be on the exchanges. If you plan to sell the um, if you plan to sell the merge, you want your coins on the exchanges at least a few days before the merge date. And I think you want your coins on the exchange by like September 10th or September 12th. Coinbase has actually announced that during the Ethereum merge, they will actually not allow deposits or um, withdrawals of, a, of ETH. So if you wait until the merge to try to transfer your assets onto Coinbase to sell, you will not be able to do that and you will be left holding the bag after the merge. Now, you can say, well, I can just sell at Kraken or I can just sell at Binance, but there's no guarantee that Kraken or Binance won't do the exact same thing. Especially if Kraken and Binance want things to go uh, smoothly. Remember, these exchanges are going to be actually pretty careful about what they do during the Ethereum merge. It is a big, big event, and they don't really want to screw the event up. So I do actually think like uh, Kraken and like uh, Gemini and all those other people, um, they could definitely uh, freeze Ethereum withdrawals and deposits. Now, you can still trade ETH on the exchanges during that time on the centralized trading services. But if you have ETH assets that you want to sell uh, before the merge, you will want it on the exchange well before the merge. Do not wait till the final day or so to actually get on the exchange. My guess is there's going to be a big like line of people that want to deposit. So they could actually have server issues as well because if everyone wants to sell the merge. So you want, so Coinbase is gonna be down for deposits and withdrawals on ETH on merge day. So you want your uh, coins on Coinbase or other exchanges uh, before the merge date. Cause I think a lot of people that don't listen to this video are actually going to get trapped and they're gonna ask a lot of YouTubers, why can't I deposit my Ethereum on uh, Coinbase or Kraken or Binance to sell? And it's because you know, a lot of these exchanges will probably lock deposits and withdrawals during the merge. Now they will probably open up afterwards, assuming that there's no problems. And but the thing is, if there is a problem and you're locked out of deposit and you're locked out of depositing on uh, one of these exchanges, you will not be able to convert into fiat, and the problem will probably cause the coin to drop massively, and you will be left holding the bag. So if you plan to sell the merge and you don't want to be left holding the bag, which I think is probably a pretty good decision overall. I do think you definitely want Ethereum on the exchange, uh, let's just say four days, four or five days before the anticipated merge, which would be around the 10th, the 11th. So hopefully you can actually find your time to do that. Hopefully you see this video before that time. So that is the news for today. Like and subscribe, hit that bell notifications button, and I will see you guys later.